Hey guys, how are you doing today? Welcome to Soft Solution Repairs and here Akhil is with you. As I told you in my last video that I'm going to upload the video about right hand side joystick replacement on Nintendo Switch Lite. Here the video is ready about right hand side joystick replacement. If you need left hand side joystick replacement video, press the card which appears on top right corner of the screen or look in the description. Anyway, back to our video. Right hand side joystick replacement is a bit complex because we have to take apart almost everything including the motherboard. So let's go ahead and begin the work. We have 1.8 mm Y screwdriver here and we are going to unscrew four of them and then additional four screws, two screws on top and two screws in the bottom side of the switch and then remove the back cover. Once back cover is removed, there are four screws holding the shield which covers motherboard and other components. Just unscrew them using 1.8 mm flip screwdriver and remove the shield. Removing the shield is a bit tricky, not hard. Just push it to the left and the shield will be removed. It sits on the housing by these two holes. After removing the shield, we'll disconnect the main flex cable which connects motherboard to daughter board and then disconnect the battery and both of the antenna ribbons. There is a blue flex cable in the corner next to the speaker. This is the right hand side joystick flex cable which we are going to replace. Then all of these screw marked in red and blue circle to strip down rest of the components. I split them into two colors because these two are different types and different sizes. So you keep red screws separate than the blues. Once all of the screws are removed, we'll take out heatsink, game card and ZR button. Then we'll go ahead and disconnect loudspeaker from the board. Touch digitizer flex cable, display O LCD flex cable, heatsink fan flex cable and then remove the motherboard. Speaker will come off with the board because it goes underneath it. After taking the board out, joystick is visible now. There are two screws holding it down. Just unscrew them and here is the broken joystick. Which we are going to replace with the new one. Just place it on, screw it down and then make sure it moves freely. Once the joystick is fitted properly, we'll go ahead and put everything back together. First of all, fit the motherboard in and make sure it sits on the housing properly and also there isn't any cable stuck underneath it. Then connect all of the flex cables. Display or LCD flex cable. Touch digitizer flex cable. joystick flex cable and both of the antenna ribbons. We'll leave the battery and daughter board flex cables for later. Now we'll put heatsink on 
but before we place the heat sink we'll have to remove old thermal paste and add new thermal paste because it dries and need replacing after time by time so now is the right time because it's already taken apart we'll go ahead add good quality thermal paste place the heat sink on and screw down the motherboard heat sink and game card that is the charging port I have another video of charging port replacement on original Nintendo Switch which you can get the link by card appears on top right corner of the screen or look in the description. We also have uploaded some videos about other game consoles like Xbox and PlayStation. Just look in our videos there are whole playlist named game console repairs. Now we'll go ahead and screw the board using rest of the leftover screws and then connect battery and main flex cable which connects motherboard to daughter board. Once everything is connected properly, we'll go ahead, place the shield on and screw it down. But before we screwing the shield, I would suggest you turn the switch on and make sure all of the button works properly, especially joystick, the one we have just replaced. And then put the back cover on and rest of the screws on the back cover and then we'll test the switch. This video is nearly finished now. Before you going to the next video, please make sure you have already subscribed to our channel and bell icon is pressed. Anyway, goodbye for now and I'll see you soon in the next video.